What's up, everybody? This is your girl, Pisces Empress 555, coming at you today with another reading for the sign of Pisces. Pisces, we're just going to take a look into your energy today, see what comes out, and then we're going to um, do an oracle message for you, okay? Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I post new readings, okay? Thank you so much to my new subscribers. I really appreciate and love you guys. Please, anyone else that hasn't subscribed, subscribe to my channel today, all right? So, leave me a comment in the comment section below to let me know if and how this reading resonates with you. All right, so let's get started. We're going to start by praying over the deck. Three shelters. Today I'm using the True Heart Intuitive Tarot deck. Messages for my Pisces, Holy Spirit. Okay, Pisces overall energy is the hangman. Okay, so at this time, Pisces, you could be feeling um, a bit in limbo, but not necessarily. You could be just at a standstill or just taking time to look over things to try to figure out what's your next move, what's your next idea, or you could be in limbo as to do I go left or do I go right? Do I go this way with this career or the other way, or do I... Um, make this type of investment or do I not make it kind of like that at a point of making a decision right and whatever decision that you're going to make you're going to go into it entirely right so you're going to fall into it entirely if that makes any sense to you then we have the ten of cups so yeah it's a decision that you definitely want to see fulfillment in. It's something that you feel like you definitely want to be happy in. So that's why you're taking the time to really think it through. Okay. So then we have the Prince of Disc. In this deck it's called. It's really the Prince of Pentacles. Okay. So yeah, something that you are going to feel really happy about, excited about. You could feel like you're going to make a lot of money if you're in the stock or making extra money on your job or... Um, just gaining more assets from whatever decision you try to make at this time, okay? It could even be a love situation. You could feel like you're going to get more out of a relationship with this person versus anyone in your past, okay? If that makes any sense to you. Or self-love, feeling like you are doing more things to fulfill yourself at this time. We have the strength card, yeah, feeling stronger, feeling happier, this is really good energy, Pisces. And you're just at a point now where you're able to look and want to make a decision as to how can I really capitalize on my abundance? How can I capitalize on what I have and where I've been, okay? We have the Six of Wands in the upright. This is fire energy. You could have been dealing with a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, at a point where you're able to take what you've learned, take the lessons that you've learned, and put them towards something great, right? So it's like gathering up all of the lessons and all of the struggles and all of that and using that as a catapult into your next level. Wow, Pisces, that's great. We have the Nine of Cups in the reverse coming out of an energy where you didn't feel like you could manifest anything. You didn't even see yourself being happy again. But now you're coming out of this where you can actually see your own happiness and yeah I think it's at a point where you've had a taste of your happiness again and you want more of it all right 
So let's clarify the Nine of Cups in the reverse. Clarify the Nine of Cups in the reverse, Holy Spirit. Clarify the Nine of Cups. All right, we have the King of Swords. You could have been dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. So at this time, Pisces, you are at a point of feeling, I believe you're feeling pretty good. I believe you're feeling like, okay, whatever comes my way, I'm not going to sweat it. I'm not going to like avoid it. I'm going to take it head on, okay? And guess what? With all the lessons that I've learned, I know how now to handle stressful situations, to handle situations that... I may have to be a bit more challenged then than others, okay? So you're taking it by storm where you couldn't see yourself manifesting <clears throat> and didn't see your happiness happening again. You're at a point now that whatever it takes, you're going to get there, okay? Wow. Taking a look at the overall energy of the reading, we have the six of disc in the reverse or six of pentacles, yeah. Coming out of this energy, I'm not seeing things happen for you so now you're seeing things happen okay so you're definitely in a state of feeling more successful feeling more focused feeling more like um, you're getting your life back on track um, getting your relationship life back on track you could be dating again you know just feeling like okay I'm ready to embark on a new journey all right so we're gonna do an oracle and then we'll close out the reading <clears throat> All righty. Messages for my Pisces, or a message for my Pisces Holy Spirit. Or a message from a Pisces. Alrighty, we have the abundance card in the reverse. We have the taking risk card in the reverse. So yeah, overall energy is stillness. So you're at a point now, Pisces. Like I said, you are at the beginning of the reading. We had the hangman. You are still thinking about your next move. Okay, you want to make sure it's going to be one that you can really come out of this energy of being a, being scared to not take risks and being at a point where you can actually see yourself abundant, right? You want to see abundancy whatever with whatever choice you make. You want to come out of that energy of not having that abundancy and not feeling confident enough to take risk, okay? So let me clarify those two cards. Yeah. You want to be able to get out of this energy, too, of not going anywhere. You want to reverse voyage. You want to feel like, okay, I want to get somewhere. I want to get somewhere with this idea of this new venture. That's why you're taking your time. We have, yeah, see? It's just a lot of energy that you were feeling where whatever this idea or this dream or this career or whatever it was, relationship that you used to have or something, you didn't feel like you were going forward. We had the going forward card in the reverse. Yeah. So you're coming out of that. Yeah, you're embracing the change. You have the embracing card. You're embracing the change. So with the with the change that you're going to make, whatever decision it is, you're going to be free to make the best choice. You're going to take risk. You're going to go forward. You're going to embark on new things. And with those new things, you're definitely going to be abundant, right? Because you're embracing what challenges it's going to take for you to go through to get to that abundancy. Okay? Wow. You just, I think you're taking the time to think it through before you just jump into something new. Okay? Great stuff, Pisces. Thank you so much for coming out and checking out a new reading. Another reading, okay? Look at some other readings on my channel. <laughs> If you guys have a moment, thank you to my new subscribers. Anyone else, please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. 
and share and also hit the notification bell so you can be updated when I post new readings okay also leave me a comment in the comment section below to let me know how and if this reading resonates with you thank you to the subscribers that leave me comments I really really love that guys I really love to give you feedback back I give you all the love that I have I pray that you come back and look at more readings and I hope it resonates for you please please do me the favor and have a blessed and safe day and until next time this is your girl Pisces Empress 555 bye